President Mohamedou Buhari arrives at Eagle Square for Nigeria's 58th independence anniversary with an inspection of guards. Vice President Professor Yami Oshibajo, former heads of state, members of cabinet and diplomatic corps, religious and traditional rulers are also here. It's been eight years since Nigeria last celebrated in this fashion, witnessed by thousands of Nigerians. March passed in slow and quick times, also observed by the president for the first time since assuming office in 2015. A ceremonial parade comprising of armed forces, police and other paramilitary agencies went on display to the excitement of all. The women's special battalion thrills the crowd in an acrobatic display. The Nigerian army also showcases the nation's military hardware as well as air displays. These military equipment might be seen by many for the first time, but they've been deployed in many successful search and rescue efforts across the country. The gun salute wraps up the displays as the president signs the anniversary register. In 2017, President Muhammad Buhari inspected a military parade while celebrating the independence anniversary with soldiers in Borno State. It's a fantastic time for our country and we're all very hopeful, we're all very uh, expectant of a greater and much greater future for the nation. A child born seven years ago has no idea whether we celebrate our national day. So uh, I want us to look at this particular incident today with, with retrospect and uh, appreciate the fact that we've come a long way. Well, this is the first time since the 2010 bombing in the nation's capital that Nigeria will be having a full-fledged Independence Day celebration. Clearly speaks volumes about the kind of confidence and the pace Nigeria has adopted, especially in the fight against insecurity going forward. From the Eagle Square, Abuja, Gloria Umezuke, Channels Television News.